Hey guys, it's me. I'm finally back. <laughs> I had some issues with my um, internet connection. The internet um, cords and all that stuff is set up upstairs and I have my main desktop computer downstairs and um, there wasn't a way, there wasn't another cable thing down there for the modem to go. So I had to order a wireless, a wireless um, wi router adapter, no, a wireless USB adapter. So I had to wait for that to come in the mail. So here I am finally. Um, unfortunately, I cannot find my remote to my camcorder, so that's making me mad, but whatever. So if you see me reaching up here like that, I'm reaching towards the, uh, the, um, end button or record button or whatever. Anyway, that's besides the point. <laughs> I'm back, okay? Um, school's going great. I'll probably have a separate video for that. Okay, so this video is about MakeupMania.com. I know a lot of people have been ordering things from there. Um, they sell Graftobian. I think they sell some Krylon um, items. They sell La Femme. And that was the main thing that I was interested in was the La Femme blushes. So I placed an order um, before I moved. So it was probably right around Valentine's Day, somewhere in that area. Place to order for some La Femme blushes as well as a couple other things that I needed. I needed a um, cake eyeliner sealer for my uh, Ben Nye cake eyeliner cake and also I wanted to try some of the La Femme cake eyeliners. Um, I don't really like those but that's besides the point too. <laughs> so anyway, um, I placed the order and about a week and a half later, you know, I'm still not hearing anything back. I haven't received a confirmation email or anything. So I'm like, okay, what's up? So I call them and I'm like, you know, what's going on with my order? Because it kept saying awaiting fulfillment. And I'm like, okay, how long does that take? You know, someone needs to advise me of, you know, what I'm expected, you know, what am I expecting to get my products? So I called them and I called them on a Wednesday, I think. And the lady was like, oh, well, um, they're going to be in here, they're going to, uh, I guess the La Femme, the Femme, ugh, the La Femme blushes were out of stock. It would have been nice to receive an email about that or something, you know. So she said that they should be in stock the next day. So I said, okay, you know. So anyway, this is what, I, let me show y'all how they sent me my stuff. This is what they sent my blushes in, okay. Now mind you, I ordered the La Femme blushes without the pot. They put all of them in this thing like this. And this is how, just how janky and bootleg it is. Ooh. This is how bootleg it is. They're just like this. There's nothing. And then they wrote on the back of them. I don't know if this is how they normally come, but they were just in there like that. And I didn't buy a palette because I'm thinking that these are going to come like individually, you know, in an individual little plastic case or something like that. They just stuck all four of them in this thing and called it a day. So I was pissed off about that. So after waiting all that time for my order, that's how my products came. Besides that, they screwed up my order. There were two items that I didn't receive. I had ordered a cake eyeliner in copper and I had ordered the cake eyeliner sealer. The whole point of buying the cake eyeliners. Neither one of those items was in my um, package. So I call them and I'm like, you know, where's my stuff? Da, 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 da. Now mind you, now this is getting closer to the time when I'm moving. So I'm like, they. I think I called them on... A Monday or something I told them that I would be moving that Saturday so she said oh no it'll be it'll get to you in time um, as long as it, if, if you call us by Wednesday it'll definitely get there before Saturday that's what they said so I'm waiting 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 don't know where my package is I'm calling them they act like they don't know what's going on oh it's probably lost in the mail and I'm like how's it lost in the mail all of my other information that was forwarded to my new address has already been to you know has already gotten to my new address so what's the problem you know so I don't know, it had been about a week or so, and I'm calling them, and I'm still getting the runaround, and I said, you know what, just give me a refund. I'm tired of the BS. Just give me my money back. It's only $6.50, but at the same time, that's my hard-earned money that I worked for. So just give me a refund. I don't know where my package is. I'm calling all of the postal services in my area because I don't know which one um, delivered the mail to this area. No one knows what I'm talking about, so whatever. So, um... I told the girl to just give me a refund, so she said okay, and then she's like, oh, well, since you paid PayPal, it's going to take a while, and I'm like, okay, I paid PayPal on eBay, and when someone issues you a refund, I had an issue with a product that came kind of damaged, and I got the refund instantly as soon as they put it through, so it doesn't take a long time for them for that to happen. It's not like it, it takes like, you know, three business days to process or something, so she was giving me the runaround, and she's like, oh, well, we're sending you a confirmation email. Never got a single solitary email about anything. So I was pissed off about that. 
and then you know having to wait for the refund finally one day I get an email and I should have saved it I deleted it because I thought the money would already be in my account so I get an email saying um, the six dollars and fifty cents has been posted to your PayPal account so I just immediately delete the email because it was the same as um, the email I had gotten from eBay and there was no problem the money was right there so I think the next day I go to the post you know to the mailbox and there's my package and I'm like okay finally then I go to check my PayPal um, thing and they never issued me a refund at all there was never a transaction for six dollars and fifty cents so I was just pissed <laughs> I was just so pissed off with makeupmania.com and it's like it's so many more things that I wanted to order from them but I'm so skeptical with spending my money because it took well well over a month to finally get everything taken care of customer service sucks um, they're just not on top of their game I know I know this might be an isolated incident and I'm not saying this for you know you to not shop there but I just want you to be wary that I had some serious issues with the company I mean from this BS whatever they want to call this not informing you that a product is out of stock and you know if the product is out of stock why should I have to wait for the rest of my items, you should have sent the things that were in stock instead of me having to wait two weeks to get anything at all. So I was just highly disappointed with them. Um, there were still some things I wanted to buy, but I just can't see myself spending more money with them. Like I know the little Graftobian, um, I think it's like a half ounce um, foundation, the HD foundation. Their website is only $9 and most of the other websites, like the theater websites are like $14.95. So I'm like, should I take the chance and try to order from them again? or just leave it alone and right now it's just it's leave it alone because I just cannot deal with that anymore so anyway that was just my makeupmania.com experience like I said I'm not trying to deter anyone from ordering from them I just want you to be aware that they have some issues and it's hard to contact somebody through customer service and they don't answer the emails either because I sent several emails and they don't respond to them so just keep that in mind before you order. <laughs> anyway, um, I'm sorry, but I didn't tell you I really love the blushes, but I will be finding another website to order these from because, yeah, I can't deal with them. So anyway, guys, I'm so glad to be back. Thank you for um, subscribing, leaving me messages and everything. I know I have been gone for a while, but like I said, I had the issue with the computer. So I know I still have that yellow eyeshadow look to do, so I haven't forgotten about you, honey. I haven't forgotten about you. Um, next week, I actually have spring break, so hopefully I can bust out some more videos because um, I have class all day tomorrow and Sunday. So I don't know. But anyway, guys, it's nice to be back, and I hope you guys enjoy the video, and I will talk to you next time. Bye.